Hey everyone, it's Dave. Um, just a quick video update. First of all, we want to say thank you so much for getting us to seventy thousand uh, dollars. We very much appreciate it. Um, it's been great so far. Uh, we appreciate uh, all your posts. Um, the fact that uh, you've been uh, posting comments and sending emails and contacting other people, we just um, we're very thankful. So thanks so much. Um, also wanted to let you know that the official Zojoy Shadowgate forums are up and this update actually has information about that so if you check that out that'd be great. Um, part of that is to, you know, if you've got any questions about Shadowgate or the Kickstarter uh, campaign or any of the other McVentures, um, we want to answer those. So I thought I'd start off by answering a few now that I've gotten. Um, one is um, how long Carl and I have known each other. I guess it goes back to like 1980 or so. Um, we knew each other in high school, but we didn't um, really become friends till after that. Um, I was working on a uh, Apple II, just doing some graphics on it for fun, and I met a programmer named uh, Terry Schulenberg, and uh, Terry uh, was working on Uninvited, one of the McVentures, and he lent um, me a, uh, a Mac, a black and white Mac, and um, Carl would come over, and I would do the art, and uh, we would both do the design and he did the majority of the writing and it was a great time. Uh, soon after that, uh, I guess it took seven or eight months after that, um, ICOM hired me and then I hired Carl and we got a chance to cut Shadowgate down because it wouldn't fit on a disc. So we cut out a lot of rooms like there was a giant spider room and um, this prayer room that the wizards would go to and um, there was the black axe and there was a black hole I think as well you change yourself to the ground so you didn't get sucked in and um, there was a basilisk that turns you to stone and I think there was something behind the the well the door in the well room but I, just, I just don't remember and so it's it's again most of them got cut because of space but also some of the puzzles weren't that good so I guess the last thing about that would, as far as Shadowgate goes, is um, the name of the game. And it was originally called Tarkus, and then it was called the Behemoth, or just Behemoth, and then it was called Shadowkeep, and then we settled on Shadowgate, and that was working with um, uh, the publisher over at Mindscape, so that's how it became Shadowgate. And there might have been another couple names in there, but I don't remember. Um, but that's it. So, I want to tell you about the forum, I wanted to say thanks again. And um, we hope that you post on it and continue to um, just support us. Uh, thanks so much.